If you are generating vectors with AI and you are not converting it into SVG files, it means you are not actually generating the vectors. This is just a simple image. And the good thing about SVG is it never pixelates and you can always edit it later in any of your favorite editing software. And in this video, I'm going to show you two ways how you guys can turn your simple images into SVG files. Okay, so the first tool we're gonna use is from Adobe and this is completely free to use. So this is the URL of this AI tool. I will also provide the link of this tool in the description below. You can drag and drop your images or select from your device. So I'm gonna pick this vector that I have generated in Stable Diffusion. And now this AI tool is converting this. So we have to wait for it. Okay, so it didn't take much time to convert it into a vector. And now we have the option to download this image. Unfortunately, we don't have the before and after option over here, but don't worry, I'm gonna show you. So just click on that download. Okay, so now to show you the results, I'm using this online SVG Weaver uh, because I'm not using right now any kind of uh, softwares like Adobe Illustrator. So I'm gonna upload this image and I'll show you the improvements in this image. Okay, so our file is uploaded and you can see this is the vector image that we have just converted into a SVG file. And if I zoom it in, doesn't matter how much I zoom it in, it will never pixel it and you can see each and every pixel and you can see we have uh, some kind of flaws in it. Uh, this is not looking professional but if we not go to in the detail like this, these are some really good results. You can see how much I zoom it in, it is not pixelating. And now you guys can easily edit it into any of your favorite softwares like Adobe Illustrator. And the second method that is uh, that I'm gonna show we're gonna use is vectorizer.ai and this is my favorite tool i have already made video on this tool but i'm gonna show you in comparison to adobe so i'm gonna select my file let's say i'm gonna select this same file and now it's uh, being processed okay so now this is converted into a vector and look at the before and after if i zoom it in you can see the details i think this is much more cleaner and smoother than the adobe's uh, results you can see the details and the smoothness and the sharpness on the uh, hairs and everything is spot on. There are some flaws in Adobe's conversion, uh, but this is looking much more better than the Adobe. And uh, just click on that OK. And if you want to download this, just click on that download. And we also have different options to download. Like you can download this into SVG, EPS, PDF, ENG file. And we also have some other options. And if you guys want to play around with these settings, uh, you can play with it uh, but I would prefer to keep it default and one more way to make the SVGs that is not actually gen converting the images into a SVGs that is a tool called recraft.ai and if you haven't watched my video on recraft.ai you should definitely watch that video this is the first AI tool that allows you to generate actual vectors with just a text prompt so I will highly recommend you guys to watch that video and I'm gonna leave the link of that video in the description below. So there was a quick video how you guys can convert your simple AI art into SVG files. And that's it from this video. And if you guys in a space of AI, make sure to subscribe to Planet AI and I'll see you in the next one.